Ay. Never worry about a single hating motherfucker looking like my next up. All these moves that I'm making got people talking like how many papers is this man signing? I'm back with a backpack rap and I'm thinking. What's up, guys? I'm back with another video, and today I have a nice unbat uh, unboxing slash unbagging for you guys. And before I get into that, I want to address a few things. So the reason I haven't been posting videos is for the fact that I'm lazy. The fact that I've been lacking motivation to, well not motivation, but creative inspiration. And number three, I got a nose ring. No, I'm just kidding. Number three, I've been focused on the gram. So the reason I've been focused on the gram is because I don't want my channel to be just unboxings and unbaggings and stuff like that. I want it to be like all around street culture, like clothing and sneakers, etc. But I don't want it to just be sh me showing you guys what I picked up. I want it to be like how to style things and all those things. So I've been sitting back, took a back seat, and I've been cranking the gears and trying to come up with new content before I started recording, as well as getting new equipment. I got a new lens in the last video you've seen it. I probably won't use it for videography, more so for photography. But either way, I'm still focused on like getting better at you know the camera aspect of things, getting better at bringing content that I personally um, am proud of, more so to say. Um, I mean, I want you guys to enjoy it, but at the end of the day, if it's something that I'm not proud of, then it really doesn't matter to me so much that it is getting views, if that makes sense. Like I was saying, I've been focused on the gram and the gram's been going really, really well. And I'm probably gonna make a video of like a before and after of when I started to uh, focus on the gram and post more consistently and show you like the growth. I mean, it's nothing crazy, don't get me wrong. Like I'm not famous on the gram, obviously. I'm not famous on YouTube, so it's nothing like wild. But I think it's pretty dope and it, I'll just probably give a couple tips on how I decided to you know go in that direction and how i made it grow with all that being said i'm gonna have more content coming to you guys very very soon um some stuff some ideas i got like rattling around in this noggin here so hopefully i get it to you guys and hopefully i'll be proud of it and with all that being said let me get off this soapbox and bring you what i have today is a pretty dope unboxing i've been picking up stuff left and right honestly the last video I posted was a collection of what I picked up the last few weeks and um, that was probably like two wor weeks worth of pickups but I think the last time I posted was like a month or two so yeah it's a little disproportionate but I've been picking things up all summer long and I don't really want to go into every single thing. If you want to see how I style something though I'm going to make a video about some of it but all of it will definitely be on my gram because that's where things get flexed flex them for the gram you know what i'm saying let's get back to this unboxing so the first thing i have for you guys is voila i doubt you'll be able to see it i doubt this will come on camera and i don't really hold on this is focus first thing i have for you guys i doubt the lettering is coming up on camera but it's the fear god fog pack essentials um this is part of, I'm not even sure which drop this is. I think it's part of collection two. And these are just the fog leggings or the feggings, I like to call them. I picked these up from the homie. Um, he doesn't really use social media so much, but I'll link his uh, stuff down below, especially his GOAT account, because he's always selling sneakers. Um, me and him go way back, so it's pretty dope. He got me these on the steel price of retail retail gang gang these are probably white blasted so i'll probably throw up some uh b-roll for you guys but essentially it's just a legging and these are super super dope for spring and summer because it's i mean if you're like me i hate wearing shorts i don't like to show off my legs not that i'm not proud of my legs because i mean my, my stuff is nice you know i'll be hitting the gym or whatever so that ain't nothing new but um if you uh just don't like the look of shorts and I'm one of those people shorts just don't look dope to me so I like to wear these leggings or I guess feggings anyway so the pants let's get into the pants let me stay focused for you real quick you have an all over cream colorway the top is a um, jock band like a compression shorts I would say and some Calvin Klein underwear that I have reminds me of this um it fits pretty tight up top i would say it fits pretty tight overall i think most of the stuff for fog except the long tees fit pretty tight anyway 
Uh, it's an all-over waffle-esque type uh, ribbing, I guess you could say. Waffle ribbing, pretty dope. Comes with a nice hang tag, nice Fog Essentials hang tag. The Fog Fear of God Collection 2 uh, tag on the inside. And then you have the um, cuffs at the bottom. Pretty dope, if I do say so myself. People say go a size up if you want that stacked look. I mean, I'm a large and I got these and I think that in my personal opinion, it's enough stacking for me. I'm not big on like the over stacking and I'm not big on the rest of the pant fitting large like in other areas. So this fits my waist and it's hard like I always say in every video for me to find pants that fit my legs and my waist because my waist is about a 30 and my legs are about a 32 to a 34. So for me this goes, I say it fits true to size but I've heard other people say size up, so I don't really know. If you're looking to cop it, I mean, it's been sold out for a while now. I'm surprised if you haven't copped it. Maybe you just didn't hear about it. It's probably on eBay. I wouldn't recommend it necessarily just for the fact that you could probably find this for other branding if you look hard enough and if it's in season. But if you need it because it's fog, check eBay. I'll look around. Maybe I'll link something in the description down below. And that's enough about these. Let me get to the next piece. All right, so the next piece, and I'm much more excited about, is these shorts I picked up from Minimal LA. Shout out to my guys over there. They're keeping it dope for the low. We got our invoice, cool. Hopefully I got the right size, because I'm, like I said, I'm always having trouble with the sizing. Now I picked up two shorts, but bam let me get that thumbnail real quick. All right, I picked up two pairs of shorts from Minimal LA. Obviously you need shorts for the summer and these are like um, very, these are pretty much the exact same thing as Fog. Like I said, a lot of other brands do whatever Fog brings you, whether it be essentials or even some of their higher end clothing on the Fog website. Most brands will copy it or you know bring the same thing with their own kind of twist to it for a lot cheaper. And, you know, I'm all for it because, like I said, broke boys, you know, we're out here trying to, we are struggling, we are trying to eat. So we need to get whatever we can, you know, cheaply, affordably, so we can afford the rest of those and probably shouldn't even buy those in the first place. Hopefully these fit. Unboxing these boys. I'll probably have a review up for you later. So stay tuned for that. All right, so the first pair I got right here is this gray joint. And this one right here is the more, uh, I'm more excited about this one. This is the piece I'm most excited about in this whole cop, just for the fact that I need gray shorts. And I mean, these are pretty much identical to Fear of God. Pretty dope style. This top looks a little big though, so I don't know. Hopefully they fit. But I got a size large, which is my true size. Now I'm about to throw up some B-roll of these joints just because they're super dope to me. At the top you have the nice black waistband. Uh, minimal LA on the inside or just minimal I guess I should say minimal hang tag it actually resembles the fear god tag that I just showed you guys you have the drawstrings which is very fear god like fear god esque is what I should start calling it and then you go down you have that nice dark uh, gray it almost looks like a knit but it's nice and clothy these look like they would be comfortable and on the sides you have these super dope zipper pockets and they have minimal LA on the zipper, which I think is a super nice touch. Moving on to the bottom of the short, you have the nice cutoff. And I don't know, I thought these were gonna sell out like instantly. I waited on them just to see how people were feeling and they're still on as far as I know. I'll link them down below, um, or at least whatever's available, I guess. I'll just put a link down, whatever's there is, is there. On to the last, and let me hurry up and wrap this up because I've been rambling forever. But I haven't seen you guys in so long. It should probably be all good. Next pair, all black. I'll go over this again probably in less detail. No, I'm not going to throw any B-roll up of this just because it's the same thing. But a black pair, it looks huge. I'm really nervous about these fitting because I'm going to be pissed. I, don't, I hate returning things when it's online, but... We'll see how it goes. You know, we got the fogger, fog strings, super dope, the zipper, all that good stuff. And with all that being said, I one eternity later.
All right, guys, so that wraps up the video for today. I know it's been a while since I posted, and I know that wasn't very much, but I got some dope content coming to you soon. At least in my mind, it's dope, so we'll see how it comes out. If you like this video, show some support by hitting that like button down below, and if you want to see more stuff like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to follow me on the gram because I've been much more active on there lately. So if you want to see how I style this kind of stuff, Definitely go follow me there. Link will be in the description down below. And it's probably been on the side of the screen the whole time anyway. And with all that being said, guys, that's all I got.